In this video, I will show you an example of dual of Milman's theorem. Find the load current for the following circuit using dual of Milman's theorem. See, we have RL equal to 500 ohm and we have to calculate the current through this RL using the dual of Milman theorem. If I consider this 0.5 ampere current source as current I1, the resistance of 50 ohm as R1, see they are connected in parallel. This 1 ampere as current source I2, this resistor as R2. See I2 and R2 will be connected in parallel. This 1.5 ampere current source as I3 this 100 ohm resistor as R3 see this I3 and R3 will be connected in parallel and the parallel combinations of current source and resistors are connected in series that means in this circuit I can apply dual of Milman theorem and dual of Milman theorem states that if we have this kind of circuit structure we can reduce the circuit inside this green rectangle into a simple current source whose value will be I equivalent in parallel with resistance R equivalent across this A and B terminal. So if I reduce this circuit into a circuit like that our circuit will look like this. So this will be our reduced circuit. So how do we calculate I equivalent? We will calculate I equivalent by using this formula. I equivalent will be equal to plus minus I1 R1 plus minus I2 R2 plus minus I3 R3 because here we have total three current sources and uh, divide this with R1 plus R2 plus R3 when do we consider this I1 R1 as positive when the current source I1 will supply the current from left to right then I will consider this sign as positive if the current source supplies the current from right to left I will consider that as negative see here this I1 and I2 are supplying the current from left to right so I will take it as positive and it as positive but here I3 supplying from right to left so I will consider this as negative this will be positive this will also be positive but this will be negative so here our I1 is equal to 0 0.5 R1 is 50 plus 1 into 25 plus 1.5 into 100 divided by 50 plus 25 plus 100 ohm this will result minus 0 0.57 ampere see I have considered that I equivalent will flow from left to right but here this minus sign implies that our I equivalent will flow in this direction therefore I will take it as positive if I indicate the direction of this I equivalent in this direction it will be equal to 0 0.57 I have to turn over the direction of the IQ this IQ has a value of 0 0.57 ampere now what will be the R equivalent R equivalent that means I will calculate the resistance with respect to this A and B terminal by replacing the current sources with open circuit with respect to these two terminals I will calculate our R E Q R E Q will be equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3 because they are in series which will be equal to 50 50 plus 25 plus 100 equal to 175 ohm so this R equivalent will be equal to 175 ohm and this RL equal to 500 ohm. Now I have to calculate the current through this 
500 ohm resistor see the sup see this current source is supplying current in this direction and this current will divide into two portions one will go in this direction and another will go in this direction the current that will be flowing through this rl i will denote that current with i l and that will flow from b to a terminal so our i l will equal to 170 divided by 170 plus 500 into 0 0.57 this is our special current divider rule when we have two resistors connected in parallel let's say if i consider the current through r1 resistor i will take the resistor of opposite branch r2 divided by r1 plus r2 into supply or source current and this il will be equal to 0 0.1 4 7 7 ampere which approximately equal to 148 milli ampere now i will show you a simulation to verify the circuit analysis that the current through this rl or 500 ohm resistor will be equal to 148 milli ampere nearly now let me run the simulation to verify my circuit analysis now if you look here you will see the current is flowing in this direction okay the current is flowing in anti-clockwise direction therefore as i have set this terminal as positive and this terminal as negative the current is showing the negative value 